I uh, welcome to my system here where I'm Arch Linux at this point and um, well screen fetch or new fetch depending on which distro you're on it will provide you with the correct information or not as you can see there are no icons so new fetch more information Sadi Mono Arc we have the Arc theme and we're on Bachi. Okay, so now you know where we are. I wanted to create on Arch a new Arc theme. So we have different themes and I'm missing the theme for the color of a little light orange. Takao it's called. So I'm gonna make a tutorial about how to make an, uh, our new Arc theme. There is this script on GitHub and the script has the possibility to change the color accent of arc theme so let's see if google finds it arc theme colora github something like that and then we see here eric the word that's me eric uh, these two is are the ones we are going to need for this project but everything is explained here in detail so you just have to get this one control c and then our terminal and then control v so we're cloning or copying the arc theme that's one and now we have to get scripts scripts that will change the blue color copy and then paste and now we have two folders in our system that's that. Let's go and check. We have these two here. Let's put them on the desktop. So you see. So we have these two. And this is the original. This is the most important one. And these are the scripts to change any of the colors. Now I have made the several zeros here. And it's depending on what system you are. And Tergos, Arch, Arch Supricity, Linux Mint. <laughs> what's next solace and ubuntu so well we probably can run this one this will work as well since it's also arch based so double clicking this thing and run in terminal asking for a password we are installing not installing auto config auto make and so on but he is going to install these things is installing something no everything has been installed already so i'm just reinstalling just for exercise so next up when you have all the software applications to make the new icon theme you also need to have all these scripts and we're gonna copy paste them in the right place copy don't need this anymore we go to the art team itself I'm gonna paste it here so that's it we have to change the color uh, I'm gonna check what color it was again it uh, I have a specific color in my mind and we created a new icon theme a new project and desktop tuning project and I put in the sadly extras I hope let's see if the cow is in there not yet well you see me do a git pull then so open in terminal and i'm gonna get it sorry i'm gonna get this uh, lot the latest information from github and there we are and now the cow will be there so cow it's just the color of uh, the color of orange but it's not there Let's have a look, do it like this, wrong, I've written it wrong maybe, start the flexible Bahama or kids should be here somewhere, strange thing, let me pause, all right, I've done another git push on another computer and a git pull here, and now we have the sadly ghost flexible colora Takao not this one this one and I just wanted to see what color I've chosen last time in places we'll see something 
unlike that, like this one for instance. And let's have a look by opening it with Inkscape and see what this color is. This is not Inkscape, this is Pinta. Could do it as well here probably, like so. How do I know the color? So this is the color name. Control C, cancel. Close it. So this is the kind of orange color I would like to have. It's more a sandy color, sandy orange. So whatever. It's a choice of color. And we go back to our arc theme and we change our color. Display. And this these are the lines where everything happens. So here the code must be changed nowhere else and no hashtags in front of it decide whether you want to have things in capital or not depending on um, the way you work your workflow you make um, well decisions to use always small or capital so you know in the future so Control s is safe done let's open the wallpaper and terminal here and then uh, let's go ahead this takes time well all these scripts have to run change color takes some time it uh, is going to go inside of this um, common folder and it's going everywhere but it's looking for these assets svgs and all elements as you can see already they are becoming uh, well, orange, let's call it orange. Yeah. So that's what I want to have an art team that is um, beautiful and goes well with any wallpaper that's orange or red or yellowish. So that's done. Now we have script number two to run. There are already old assets inside for the blue. Uh, arc team. So we have to delete those. Done. Three. The longest part. Now we go and drink a coffee. The longest part is this one. He's really going to recreate every little thing that's uh, to be made here. And I think he starts in GTK2 in assets. He's making every little part of your arc theme. And let's wait till we see an orange one. And then we'll pause the movie and wait for the script to stop depending on your CPU takes 10 15 20 minutes and then you have a new art team now more or less we're gonna have an orange one so we see we can leave the computer at it almost there There you go, the first orange one, and now we can pause the movie. Let's take a look. All icons have been created. The script is done, so number three has been has finished. Now number four. Final installation. If we have all the applications available on our system, like autoconf and so on. He's going to make a new arc theme. So the script is based on well on arc. So it's going to make an arc an arc dark and arc darker. So in order to have a copy of our own, we have to run script number five. So this was four. Script number five. We're gonna move this managed created icon theme and rename it. And we have adopted to cow which is the color of orange like so so now we have in our themes here a to cow team we can already check and how that will that uh, how that will look but let's go first and to the other scripts six is cleaning up so everything that's in the user share is going to be deleted that's one and our original arc theme is going to be created so the blue one is going to be downloaded 
no color changes, just the blue one back into the user share themes. Now we can go and select and see how this will look. So we will have an arc dark takao, which will look like this. And let's take something orange with it as well. So let's move around and see this is doable. This is okay. And see if this decal matches any of our icons. So the best match would be something orange like this. Or this. Even blue. It was not so bad, our blue. But let's stick with, for instance, this one would be nice. So the little orange thing here is coming back there. It's coming back in the menus and so on. Everything is now this uh, Takao color. And that's how we make a new theme on Arch Linux. There are also tutorials on Eric Dubois, on Ubuntu, on Linux Mint, on Souls, on many other distros, so it should be a distro independent these scripts and you should be able to run it. Have fun!